Once upon a time, in a far off land, there was a young student named Akira. He was determined to never fail at his studies again. But despite being a curious and diligent student, he often found himself struggling to manage his time and balance his various responsibilities. Late nights of studying left him feeling exhausted and unmotivated the next day. One day, while wandering through a dense forest, Akira's path led him to an ancient temple. Intrigued, he approached the entrance and was greeted by an old monk who welcomed him inside. Eager to seek guidance, Akira opened up to the monk about his struggles with time management and effective studying. With a warm smile, the old monk motioned for Akira to sit down and said, My young friend, the key to success in your studies does not lie in working harder, but in working smarter. Allow me to share a story with you to illustrate my point. The monk began recounting the tale of a wise master who had many students, one of whom stood out for his diligence, focus, and impeccable time management. The other students marveled at the young scholar's success and asked the wise master for his secret. He knows the value of time, replied the master simply. Puzzled, the students questioned further, but don't we all have the same amount of time? The wise master smiled and explained, indeed, we all have the same amount of time. However, it is how we use that time that determines our success or failure. The story resonated deeply with Akira, yet he remained uncertain about how to apply it to his own life. Sensing his hesitation, the monk continued, time is a precious resource, my young friend. Once it is gone, we cannot retrieve it. If you truly wish to never fail at your studies again, you must learn to value your time and use it wisely. The monk imparted further wisdom, emphasizing that good study habits weren't solely about working hard, but also about working efficiently. He advised Akira to prioritize his tasks, create a well-balanced schedule that allowed for both work and leisure, take breaks when necessary, and remain focused on his goals. The monk stressed the importance of nurturing the mind and body while avoiding distractions. Filled with inspiration, Akira bid farewell to the wise monk and embarked on a journey to apply the newfound knowledge to his life. He diligently began to develop a new routine that allowed him to study effectively without compromising his well-being or happiness. Akira learned to manage his time better, taking breaks to refresh his mind and maintain focus on his objectives. As time passed, Akira's efforts bore fruit. He transformed into a successful student and scholar, carrying the wisdom of the old monk with him every step of the way. Even after graduating, Akira continued to apply the teachings, realizing that good study habits weren't just meant for academic success, but also for triumph in the journey of life. In conclusion, the tale of Akira and the wise monk reminds us that true success in both studying and life is not solely achieved through hard work, but also through working smart. To never fail at studies or any endeavor, we must learn to cherish and utilize our time wisely. Remember, valuing time and working efficiently can pave the path to greatness.